Yo, what is good? Thanks for clicking on the video and watching it. It's your boy back here in the building, back with another Madden Ultimate Team gameplay, and we are playing against the Rams. I think this is, if I'm not mistaken, the third game of the season. And right now, my record happens to be one and one, so I'm trying to get a win here, trying to get myself back on uh, winning record, putting another W in the win column. And that won't happen if we keep giving up big plays like that. Here my opponent gets the big bomb to Steve Smith Sr. Who breaks like two tackles on his way for a big game. Second and 10, my opponent's dropping back with Andrew Luck. And he finds, I think, I would assume that's Kyle Rudolph. Second and goal, passing it. And here, Clinton Dix had the interception. If he would have caught that, that would have been a clear path to the end zone. Oh my goodness. Third and goal, my opponent's dropping back. And he finds... Can he break in the back of the end zone? He has a lead 7-0. And my defense pretty much stunk it up that drive. I gotta improve on my defense. What else more can I say? Here returning the kickoff, and I'm getting some nice blocks from my kickoff return. Oh my goodness. Leon Washington on his feet. Leon Washington doesn't normally do that. I've been meaning to I'm meaning to quick sell Leon Washington for the longest. I'm trying to get a better kick return. Second and four, dropping back. <sighs> A bad read by me. Eric Berry just jumped that route so quick. Oh my goodness. Eric Berry's a freaking beast. Second and goal. He's dropping back with Andrew Luck. And he's doing all this zigzag and throwing it up in the back of the end zone. Dante Whitner, you had it. Dante Whitner, you freaking had it. That's two drop intercepts in this game. Yeah, they only got away with the field goal. But we could have gotten an interception. And they would have gotten no points. Dang it, I hate dropped interceptions. Again, Leon Washington returning to kickoff. And oh my goodness, Leon Washington doesn't normally do this. Breaking tackles, juking people, that's that's not normal Leon Washington. That is crazy. With only a little bit left in the first quarter, we handing it off to Frank Gore. He gets a nice healthy game. Second and two, dropping it back, dropping it to Greg Olson. I don't know how I got it through there. There wasn't really much action in the second quarter. I was just trying hard to drive it down, and I came away with the field goal. So, yeah, we could just skip on to the second half. And I tried to hit him with the mean juke move, but, you know, he made sure that the second man was there. First and 10, trying to get at least a touchdown. I don't want to come away with the field goal. You can't win, you can't win games by just getting away with field goals. So, I'm doing all this changing and switching and, and changing routes. At the line and I throw it up and it's picked off again and all that was for nothing oh giving him the ball right back first and ten dropping back finding oh my goodness that was a close interception right there too by Ha Clayton Dix we just need a we just need a turnover that's all we need we need to stop his drive we just need a turnover but we're not doing that now. He hands it, he passes it to Kyle Rudolph, and he gets a good chunk of yards for the first down. Second and six, Dante Whitner, a uh, freaking gin, drops the sure interception. Maybe we have to make a change at the strong safety position. That's what I'm starting to think. First and ten, dropping back again and finding Kyle Rudolph. That's like his 19th catch of the game. And Kyle Rudolph has been doing work on my defense. Second and goal, hands it off to his fullback, Sherman. He gets stuffed up at the line. We've been shutting down his running game. His passing game and Kyle Rudolph, I'm just not sure we've been shutting that down because Kyle Rudolph has been killing us all game. And that's technically my fault. That's technically my fault. I should have done a defensive adjustment. And here, oh my goodness, breaks a tackle, a lose another, and Kyle Rudolph simply walks into the end zone. Barely time in the third quarter. My main objective is to drive down the field, and I have to come away with the touchdown. Hurrying up my offense after passing it to Iman. I got him from a pack opening. I don't know where he came from, but he is pretty a decent receiver, and he's been doing work for me, so why not keep him on the team? First and 10, dropping back with Cam Newton. Can't find anything, so I just decide, but I get a good chunk of yards, about eight yards. Third and two, decide to take the safe route, and oh my goodness, handing it off to Frank Gore for the first down. Second and five, doing work on offense. A beautiful pass to Brandon LaFell in between the cornerback and the safety. First and ten, dropping back play action. Finding Alan Hearns for the touchdown. 
cutting the lead and bringing the deficit back down to only seven. First and ten, my opponent has to be. Ooh! Ooh! Ooh, Luke Keekly. Take a seat. My opponent with the back to on Luke. <laughs> I'm thinking that my opponent's probably gonna run the clock down. Try to keep the ball away from me as he doesn't want to put his lead in jeopardy. Third and six, he's dropping back and passing. He gets the first down. A risky play, but manages to get the first. First and ten. Only thing he has to do is run the clock now, but he decides to run it with this QB and he fumbles. Michael Johnson with the recovery. And with less than two minutes left, three timeouts, I have plenty of time to drive it down the field and get the game tying touchdown. First and ten, passing it down to Iman, a guy that I got from Pack Opening, I assume. I don't know where he's from, but he's he's been doing work. Very decent wide receiver. Second and four, running that play action sweep. Finding Iman, but he cannot hang on to the ball. A costly play. Fourth and one. Decide to just run it off with Frank Gore. He gets the first down. Gotta give it to Mr. Reliable. First and ten. Dropping back. I see Brandon LaFell wide open. And Cam Newton connects for the game time touchdown. But I left my opponent with a little bit over a minute on the clock. I get the sack here with Starling the too late, whatever his name is. But third and 20. My defense. Can my defense come up big? Can it come up big? Third and 20. Dropping back. <sighs> but finds Kenny Brick. And he does a smart route. He just decides to die. But that's it for the gameplay. As we all know, my opponent will kick the field goal to end the game. I didn't get the game time, the game winning field goal because I was pissed as shit. But if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. And I'll probably be coming out with another video again tonight. So stay tuned. But this is your boy Jeff the Meth and I'm out. Peace.